Hey, today I'm going to review another YouTuber, Riray of Sunshine. She talks about defending Disney princesses, not Nintendo princesses, but Disney princesses. Okay, this ought to be interesting. All right, so here's her YouTube channel. And... In defense of the Disney princesses, this is a video I'll review. She was sentenced to death. Huh, who was sentenced to death? Welcome back to my channel and surprise! We are not doing makeup today. I am going to make a case against those who say that Disney princesses are bad role models. I've got the facts, the receipts, the tea. Cinderella? She's got the tea. Let's start with the classic Disney princesses. We have Snow White, Cinderella, and Aurora. Princesses that people say needed a prince, who needed to be saved. Uh, just like Princess Peach needed to be saved by Mario from Bowser. So if you take a step back and remove your adult criticizing lenses, you'll find that these classic princesses stories are about staying strong and keeping a kind heart. Okay, I guess they stay strong and keep a kind heart. You know, that would be hard for me to do if I was kidnapped by seven dwarves. And, uh, yeah. Are they good role models or not? And I'm here to say a definitive yes. And before you can say that Ariel left her family and kingdom for a man, let me stop you right there. Ariel left... Her kingdom and her family for a man? Um, I don't think I would be okay with marrying a mermaid. Yeah, I would kind of feel like I'm marrying part of a fish too. human was crazy downright crazy like i'm not gonna deny that it was crazy right um oh um, ariel became human i guess when she married a human okay maybe that would make it less strange to marry a mermaid the message is clear that some risks are worth taking some rules are worth breaking if your heart is in the right place we've reached the revival princesses the strong ones the ones with superpowers <laughs> we've reached tiana rapunzel merida anna elsa and i am moana tiana i haven't heard of that princess really didn't need a man to make it happen. They didn't need a man to make it happen? I'm not sure I follow along. We can find true love with Elsa. Well, she, I'm not finding true love with Elsa. Okay, that's important to know that you're not finding love with Elsa. Okay, so I guess her main argument for defending the Disney princesses saying that they're not a ro bad role model is mainly the main thing I got from the video is that they aren't bad role models because they are examples of taking big risks to accomplish your dreams. 
even if it goes against your family norms and all of that. Okay, but uh, she was uh, defending them, but she didn't really talk about the opposition or like why were people thinking that they were bad role models. Because I never really thought much of the Disney princesses as being bad role models. But I could understand how the idea of being willing to sacrifice anything at all costs to accomplish your dream can be controversial because it's like what if a princess or a girl or whatever you know what if uh, like they wanted to make a living selling uh, feet pics on Instagram or something like that it's like and then their parents are like you know I think you could amount to so much more why do you want to just sell feet pics and she's like willing to sacrifice everything you know I don't know yeah I could see how that could be controversial okay anyway that's my review of the video if you're a youtuber and you want me to review one of your videos be sure to let me know in the comments bye no princess bye